Installing the Fuser Maintenance Kit in the HP LaserJet 4100 series printers. Be sure you turn your printer off and allow it to cool for 30 minutes before beginning. Turn off the power and then remove the power cord. Once it's cool, remove the rear tray cover. Flip open the rear exit door, press in on the left and then the right will come out. There are two tabs on the fuser. Flip those up. They will unlock the fuser and you can slide it straight out. Take your new fuser, slide it in, lock down the tabs, reinsert your exit cover on the right, Press it in on the left, close your cover, reinstall your rear tray cover, come around to the front of the printer, remove your toner cartridge, and be sure you cover it with a piece of paper, not to expose it to light. Take your tool provided. On the left side of the transfer roller, there's exposed metal shaft. Pull up on the shaft there. Lift the transfer roller out from left to right. Reinstall it on the right and then drop it in on the left. Press down to snap it in. Remove your front cover. Insert a small flat blade screwdriver in the front roller. It pops open. Lift it straight up off the shaft. you notice there's a pin inside of it that matches a hole in the shaft. Reinstall your new one straight down on, and it's easy to press it on with your thumbs. It'll snap in. Reinstall your envelope cover. Pull out your paper tray, not all the way. There's a door. Flip open a small door and pinch the end of the feed roller in the tray. It'll slide off the shaft. You can then replace the feed roller. Slide in your new feed roller. Close the door and remove the paper tray completely. And inside the printer there's one feed roller. Again it's the same. Pinch the end of the roller. The clip will let it remove off the shaft. Install your new roller. Reinsert your paper tray. Then reinstall your print cartridge. Now with the printer off, you want to hold down on the left side of item and value and then turn it on. And you'll see on the display, reset maintenance count. When that's done, you can remove your fingers. It will come up ready. Press the menu until you see information menu, and then item until you see print configuration, then select. Print the configuration page and ensure that your page count has been reset for the maintenance. And it's complete.